Hi guys and welcome back to Making Games with Unity. Today I'm going to teach you on how to use typecasting. So if you want to know on how to use typecasting, please watch this video. So what is typecasting? Typecasting is the process of converting one data type to another data type. Alright, so in our code right now, we get a float data type here and the score is 100.45F. And then we have a debug log here that will lag this score. So let's save this and go to Unity project. Let's clear, clear that first. Then let's hit play. And now as you can see that the score is 100.45. But the problem is what if we want to show the 100 only? So I think we need to convert our score to a whole number like integer. So to do that, let's typecast it. I'm going to put int here. So this open and close parenthesis here with int is typecasting the score to become an int. So let's save this, go to our Unity project, and then let's hit play. And then you have it. So yeah, our plot become integer by using the typecasting, which is this one. So from plot we convert it to int. All right, so there's another way on how to typecast, how to use typecast in Unity. So I'm going to put a public text mesh pro here. I'm going to put a text score text, and then I'm going to use the set text, and I'm going to use the score. But right now we get some error because this set text required a string data type, but our score is float so i'm going to put to string so what happened here is we type cast our flow to string so finally the error disappeared so i'm going back to our project here and yeah bam i already added the text mesh pro here so that you won't wait for that so i'm going to drag our text here all right so it's there so when we when i play this see our score become 100.45 so yeah so that's how you use typecasting to typecast score to string so there's there's more way to typecast a data type usually you don't need this but sometimes you have to do this based on your scenario so yeah i think that's it guys so i hope you learned something today about the typecasting so i hope you can use this maybe you're already using this so yeah if you forget please subscribe and tick that notification bell so that you always get updated when we upload a new video and we got more videos please check them all you need the basics you share programming basics and again thank you for watching and see you next time